When men and women visit hair salons, a common complaint is hair loss. There are many things that you may be advised to try, such as supplements, shampoos, and conditioners, or diet changes. Having a better understanding of what makes your hair grow and what you can do to help it can help shed light on what does and does not work. How fast does men's hair grow? There are many things that can determine how fast your hair grows. It isn't just a point-blank answer that can be given. On average, a healthy male or female can expect about 6 inches a year in hair growth. You have to factor in things like genetics, lifestyle, nutrition, age, medications, medical conditions you may have. All of these ailments and conditions can play a role in the production of hair growth. They can restrict it and cause it to happen slower. Some can even cause you to lose your hair. Thyroid problems are a common problem for people who have hair loss and thinning. Sometimes all it takes is to be put on a medication to help it, and you can stop that problem from occurring. Can hair growth be stimulated? There are so many sources out on the market that claim to cause your hair to grow faster and longer when you take their supplement. In all honesty, there really isn't a way to accomplish that in the way it makes you think. Your hair growth is just what it is, about half an inch per month. If you are someone who has hair that grows slower than normal, you can try conditioning it and brushing it more often. Brushing can cause stimulation to the scalp, blood flow, and it may help some. Damaged hair doesn't grow like healthy hair does. It needs moisture to grow. If you are looking for hair growth stimulation tips and tricks, the best thing to do is to get some health back into your hair strands. That could mean using a hydrating shampoo, heat protectant, or a scalp conditioning treatment. All of those things will help the condition of the hair strands, which will promote healthy hair growth. How long is the hair growth cycle? Some people get really nervous when their hair is coming out in the shower, brush, or when running their hands through it. While, yes, there are some medical conditions that can cause hair loss, most likely it's just natural shedding. Everyone's hair growth goes through three different stages during the hair growth cycle. Anagen, phase one. Catagen, phase two. Telogen, phase three. The first stage of hair growth is the longest, where it begins. It's approximately three to five years long, with your hair growing half an inch a month. The catagen stage is the middle of the process and only lasts around 10 days before the hair falls out of the hair follicle it's been living in, known as the telogen stage. That hair follicle will receive a break from hair growth in this stage for about three months, and then it starts all over again. Does hair growth slow with length? Everyone wants long, luscious, beautiful hair. It's actually hard to achieve, though. Everyone's hair length isn't created equal. Have you ever heard someone say, my hair gets to this length and it's like it just doesn't want to grow anymore. Our bodies all work differently, and that also goes for our hair growth. The speed at which our hair grows is determined on a lot more than average ratings and scientific studies. The hair can only grow so long before it hits the next phase of the hair cycle, which is when it falls out to grow new hair. The length of your hair isn't the reason that it isn't growing. It is that the hair strand has hit the last stage of growth. Does biotin really work for hair growth? Biotin and hair growth are often advertised together. Biotin is a vitamin that is highly recommended by a lot of people for hair growth. Your hair on your head and your body is made up of keratin, and biotin can nourish that in your body. There aren't any true studies that show it can cause your hair to grow longer or thicker, although it may result in it being healthy. Hair growth is determined on so many other things within your body as discussed above. Does hair growth slow down with age? Hair thinning and color loss is a common complaint by women and men as they age. Your hair follicles begin to lessen in size, and the melanin that you produce becomes substantially less as you age. Your hair growth rate will lessen by your age. Women and men in their 30s will begin to see the growth of gray hair if they haven't seen it before then. That's what happens when your hair follicles aren't producing the same amount of melanin as it once was. It can bother both sexes a lot when your hair begins to thin. Signs of aging aren't always something that's processed easily. Supplements can help. There are many different supplements that are on the market to help you with the aging process. We talked about biotin and the results that you can get from that. Although it isn't scientifically proven to cause hair growth, it can improve the production of keratin. Spermidine is a supplement that can help men and women with the aging process. The cells in our bodies slow down in production as we age. That is the aging process, and we can't stop it from happening. But 
There are some things that we can do to help the whole thing go more smoothly. Spermidine can help to activate these cells and liven them up. Hey there, thanks for checking us out on YouTube. I'm Daniel from Longevity Labs. We want you to know that we put a lot of time and energy into bringing you the best available information on how to live a longer and a happier life. Follow us here on YouTube or your favorite social channel and stay up to date with what we're working on. Thank you again, and it'll be worth your time.